You might be asking yourself, didn't we already do this episode? You know, episode one, what is 3D printing? Well, no, because while 3D printing and digital manufacturing are often used interchangeably, they are different things. 3D printing is restricted to, well, 3D printers, while digital manufacturing, as we'll discuss, is so much more. Digital manufacturing, or fabrication, put simply, is creating something through a digital file. It refers to the entire process of making a digital file, and then fabricating from it. The file, usually made through 3D modeling software, is then manufactured using additive or subtractive processes. 3D printing is just one type of additive manufacturing, which, just as it sounds, is manufacturing characterized by the adding up of smaller parts to become a single complete object, such as the layers of plastic or powder used in 3D printing. The other half of digital fabrication is subtractive manufacturing. Through this process, excess layers of a base material are removed until only the essential parts of whatever is being made remains. This might sound a bit more confusing, so let's clear it up by talking about the machines that use this process, CNC mills and laser cutters. CNC stands for Computer Numerical Control, which basically means that these machines are guided by computers instead of human hands. The computer tells the machine what to do. So, a CNC mill is like a normal mill or a lathe. It carves a shape out of a block of wood, metal, foam, or other materials using the data it receives from the computer. A laser cutter is similar in that it carves a shape out of a hole, but it uses lasers. It also was mostly used to make flat objects, which are then assembled later. Basically, think of subtractive manufacturing, like that Michelangelo quote. He saw an angel in the marble and carved until he set him free. But with computers and lasers. Thank you for watching.